be it for its salubrious climate, the taste of its drinking water or the disciplined industrial environment, Coimbatore ranks high as a preferred tier 2 destination for varied interest groups of the region. Engineering of any sorts tickled the minds of even the tiny tots of the city. The city's engineering industry was the core of its economic growth. It is in the backdrop of Coimbatore evolving as a key engineering hub of the region that a large pose of medium and small industries set shop to profile the skyline of the city's industry. It was in 1969 that there was a felt need and the idea of an MSME association emerged and through the efforts of the early group of 24 SME entrepreneurs, the nuances of forming an association was initiated. Kodisha was the outcome of this effort. Coimbatore Entrepreneurs Chief Inspirer Sri G.D. Naidu challenged the then Kodisha team members with an offer for a rent-free office in the city's main thoroughfare, Avinashi Road, if the association was able to muster up a strength of 250 members. The Kodisha team started a membership drive and soon succeeded in enrolling the mandated 250 members. G.D. Naidu gave them their first iconic office at the prestigious President Hall complex from where Kodisha launched many ambitious projects until they acquired a property to build their own office on Huzo Road, aptly naming it GD Naidu Taz. Kodisha always followed a dictum of transparency, akin the ancient Sangha Palagai. Kodisha was inspired to place on the table a transparent account of all its dealing for members' review. Kodisha initiated a prelude for the single window system of approval for projects and achieved success when the Tamil Nadu government for the first time announced the Manuniri Thittam, today heralded as the single window system for ease of doing business. The startup initiatives was an original initiative by Kodisha. As early as 1976, Kodisha helped establish 529 new startup businesses in the Coimbatore region. Kodisha soon started the trend of organizing fairs and exhibitions, early amongst which were the Job Order Exhibition and one specifically organized for cast iron specials and pipe fittings, followed by Expos for Defense and Railways, which saw Coimbatore SSI units catapult to national level ancillary supplies. Team members realized that it was time to think big and act big, the first such effort was in the organizing of Index 82, an entrepreneur development expo opening up opportunities for thousands of entrepreneurs, which was a resounding success of its times. Kodisha foresaw trade and industrial fairs as the way forward and launched the iconic Intech in 1988, an industrial trade fair that showcased interests of national and international manufacturers in Coimbatore hitherto only seen at Hanover in Germany and Pragati Maidan in Delhi and has since been conducting Intech as a regular feature once every three years. The architects of the Intech fairs had journeyed further to aspire that Intech 2000 edition of the fair be held at an exhibition ground that would be owned by the association. Kodisha entered the Limca Book of Records in 2000 with the first pillar free trade fair complex over an area of 40 acres constructing 13,500 square meters in 155 days with 1,500 workers working around the clock comprising halls A, B and C and by 2007 added halls D and E increasing the built area by another 10,000 square meters. Fairs like Agri Intech, Build Intech, Subcon, Electrotech, the Coimbatore Shopping Festival, and the Coimbatore Book Festival attract business visitors far surpassing the expectations from a trade fair complex in a tier 2 city. Kodisha has hosted the visits of many dignitaries, including Sri Atal Bihari Vajpai, Dr. Kalinga Sri M. Karnanidhi, Dr. Abdul Kalam, Sri M. Venkaya Naidu. Thiru Erapadi K. Palni Swami, Srimati Nirmala Sita Raman, Sri Siddharamaya, Sri N. Chandra Babu Naidu. An event of prestige for Kadisha was when the venue was chosen for the hosting of the World Tamil Conference in 2010, 
as it inches its way towards a golden jubilee, Kodisha has embarked on an ambitious project. Kodisha Industrial Park Limited, CIPL, a 450-acre industrial park that proposes to host over 500 MSMEs and through the setting up of its Defence Innovation Centre and the Skill Development Centre, hopes to boost defence and skill development initiatives. Coimbatore District Small Industries Association has arrived as a pre-eminent torchbearer of the MSME entrepreneurs of Coimbatore region. We are Kodisha, where teamwork always succeeds.